Tell me what you want, what you like, it's okay. I'm a little curious too. Tell me if it's wrong, if it's right, I don't care. I can keep a secret, could you? Got my mind on your body and my body on your mind. Hey there, YouTube. So I am back today with another wig show and tell. And I think it's kind of going to be a review because I'm going to get my thoughts on this wig too. So the wig I have today is called Sabella and it is from wigtypes.com. This is the wig. And the color I'm showing you guys today is the same that's on the model, which is um, SOP DKPU Dark Purple. So that's the one I will be showing you guys today. And I think the packaging is so pretty, you guys. Like, the packaging is so pretty full. Don't get me wrong, I am a sucker for pretty packaging, but I am not a sucker when it comes down to if the unit is bad. <laughs> the packaging ain't everything as much as what you ordered inside. So, let me take this wig up the package. This is her. And you guys, I love the color and I love the curls, but me... In this wig, we have beef, you guys. Like, I'm so serious. Like, I'm going to tell y'all why we have beef. So, let me come right back. Put this wig on my head. And y'all will see why we got beef. Before I do pop this wig on my head, first let me show you guys the inside construction of the cap. I just want to tell y'all why I got beef with this wig so quick. Like, I forgot to show you guys the inside. This is the inside of the cap. It has no combs. And it does have adjustable strap right there. Yeah, right there, right there. So I'm going to show y'all the top. I'm going to come back. Okay, you guys. So to me, when you do receive the wig, it do actually look just like the models, I believe, in my opinion. So... Ain't the curls pretty? I think I have on too much purple right now. Oh well. Ain't the curls pretty? I think the curls is pretty and the color is so pretty as well. It's pretty, right? So, the main reason why I don't like this wig. And I'm so mad Freetress will do this. Like, why would you do this to a pretty wig? What is that? What is that? What what is that? What's up with the parting? Why? Why? Why would you do that, free Tris? Like it's not it's no lace, you guys. Like it's no lace. And this is literally closed with probably three tracks right there and then a skin top part. Why? Why would you do something so stupid? <laughs> The wig is so pretty, and I know when I comb it out, I'm going to fall in love even more, but why would you do that to the part? What is that? Oh, my God. I've I just been trying to think of ways to, like, manipulate this part, but I can't think of anything. I thought to cut it open, but it has no comb, so it's going to be, like, slipping all over the place. Ah! Why would you do that? This was a waste of my dollars. I mean, I'm not sure if anybody out there is okay with that. But why? I'm so hurt, you guys. Like... I should have paid attention because it never said it was a lace front wig. 
but this ain't my kind of wig. The color, the curls, the texture, the length. Let me show you guys the length. I'll say it's about, I would say it's about, who knows, 24 to 26 inches on me. The curls and everything is just so pretty, you guys. Like, oh my god. It's up to my butt. Why? Uh, I had plans with this wig, but not no, I don't even know what I'm going to do with this wig. I was going to cut it open and um add combs to it. Oh my god. How would you do that? So, I'm just so tempted to brush out the curls. Let me brush out the curls then, real quick. Reach for the cherry, I just need to take a bite. Don't tell your mother. Kiss one another. Die for each other. Cool for the summer. <sighs> I, don't, I don't know what to do with this wig I don't I don't know what to do with it I was gonna um take scissors and cut right here but then I'll have to cut a lot off like you guys I don't know what to do I'm about to just split it right there and try you know I'll be right back So, you guys, I tried. I really did. Where's this under my neck? This was the best I could do. Like, I really had to cut through them tracks. Like, why would you sew three tracks in the front on this beautiful wig? Why would you do that? This was the best I could do. I love, I love from right here going down. I love it a lot. It wasn't much tangling. I use this kind of brush. I did get some shedding, but it's understandable because I did cut right here. And I did pluck right there a little bit. But this is literally the best I could do. And it to me, it looks wiggy. Like, from far away, it would not look wiggy, but you know females. Is that a wig? Yep. Look at that line right there. So, yeah. I guess one day I'm just going to cut it open and um, add some combs and just wear it as like, you know, like a part, you part or something like that. <sighs> Free tris, man. Yeah, I might as well just bring down the price of these wigs because I don't know. I don't know. It's probably make a cute bob. Yeah. So, shedding. This is how much shedding I got. Like I said, it's mostly because I did cut right there. Tangling. Tangling wasn't harsh at all. Um, The luster. I love the luster. I love the curls. Love it. I love the little ombre effect. Love the color. Just that parting. Ugh. Otherwise, hmm, I'm going to use it one day because no money is going to waste here. So, as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Tell me your thoughts on this wig. Would you get this wig? Did you like how that part come or is it just me? Let me know, you guys. Anyway, have a good day, guys. Bye.